Zekor here and we're back for another juicy debut video today we're gonna be uh, rotating it over to the sniper class and we're playing on a map that I have not played before can I not get up there as you can see I'm very oh shit familiar with this map thank you teammates okay this map is very freaking loud don't like that but anyways we're playing uh, my game mode storm or or I was gonna say the French equivalent, but I can't think right now. Um, and we're using the pirate version of the Cobalt Kinetic Kinetics 27. Um, and I and actually I was gonna say uh, I'm gonna be making like some debut videos back to back. But if you want to see like guns uh, videos with like old guns, like as I'm not using for the first time, feel free to speak up as well. And I'll make sure to do that too. Um, but anyways, this gun, uh, I've played a few games with it till now, and I don't like it honestly. Like, um, I, I generally don't like uh, semi-autos, semi-auto snipers or fully auto snipers. But playing with it, I realize like it, it's it's like a, a midway solution between rifles and and snipers that really just fucks you over and, and doesn't give you any benefit in, in either way you know like because with snipers you have a one sh with bolt action snipers you have a one shot on the body so you just aim for it, it's really easy to get those kills and this really fast kills and with rifles you have the more versatility w with your aim and, and uh, you can just go for headshots and like it's much more versatile but with these guns like if you if you don't spray like this, or if you don't go for headshots, which is very hard with a sniper like this, then you're really, uh, you really can't do anything really. <laughs> I mean, I, it's hard to explain, but I feel like this gun is very, like, it, it's not very good. Like, correct me if I'm wrong, because apparently last video on the guild, uh, guild boa, uh, there's not many comments yet because I'm not very popular anymore, but uh, Apparently I misjudged the gun because some people think it's OP and needs a nerf, but if, to me it seemed like uh, It seemed like uh, just <laughs> a pretty decent gun, I guess and So I, I don't want to like misjudge this gun, but again, these are like my opinions and not necessarily true This is such a bad Sight design, like what is this supposed to be, dude? I know it's my first time, but like this such an ass. <laughs> it's already an ass map. <laughs> okay, can we go back to finish these people off? Wait, what? Where's the last site? Oh, it's over there. Guess you can finish off these people. There's more of them. Ah. Oh. Nearly got. You see, like, if you face a bolt action sniper, a, a sniper using a bolt action, you're just fucked because they can just aim for your, uh, for your anywhere and one shot you. But you have to like either aim anywhere and s spam your shots, or you have to aim for their head, which takes more time. So like, either way, you're sort of fucked. And uh, yeah, that's my TED talk, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Um. So it has uh, two little attachments here that I should probably show off. This one gives more hip accuracy, so of course I'm going to go with it. But this one is less recoil. I don't know why you would want less recoil on this gun. And this is a silencer that reduces damage by a whopping 50%. So I'm definitely not going to use it um, typically. But you see, like that would have been such an easier kill if I didn't have that silencer. But you know, I did it for the, for the science, you know? To be a man of science, as they say. And of course I get nade killed because of this storm. <laughs> oh, what? We already finished? Okay, guys. Like, we need to calm down here. We need to chill a little bit. Um, let's take off that silencer because, trust me, you don't want to use it. 50% damage drop is, like... It's such a big impediment. Like, you don't want to try that. That was bad. 
Where am I trying to go? I don't know. Let's see. Where am I supposed to go here? What? Where the fuck did that guy appear from? That guy's back. Oh no, he's using my favorite gun. How dare is he? Why is this map so goddamn loud? I'm confused. Come on, push me. Ha. I didn't even need to make them push me. Oh. <laughs> so you see, like, um, I'm spraying a lot here, but I did, like, two FFAs and I was trying to go for headshots. And with guns like this, even though it has a red dot sight, it, it's, it's pretty pretty hard to like manage because like okay this I have no clue what that, what this map is like and this is my first time playing so it doesn't help that I'm doing it while using this gun <laughs> but hopefully this goes right here I'm trying to go for headshots here be more be more curated with my aim as you saw that headshot there and that one <laughs> Uh, but uh, as of the looks, I mean, like, the gun doesn't look too bad. It, it it looks pretty good. Oh, and I was gonna say, like, it it's it, it feels like, to me like a, a a better H car almost. I think it's like they're like sort of equivalents, and like this is just a better one because it has more bullets and I'm pretty sure more RPM too, probably. What the fuck? My team's just so oblivious. Okay, we got three minutes, but my team has been like pretty strong on the pushes here, so I, I'm pretty confident we can do this. I'm gonna go for it, boy. Just smoke it for my team because smoking is key in this game mode. I think there's one more there. Go from here. So there's the headshot I was talking about. And when you get close to people, this gun basically acts like a, you can use it as a shotgun in a way. Oh, is this their spawn? It doesn't have great hip accuracy, but um, the, the grip attachment here... Oh, let's go back to it. It increases hip, hip accuracy. Um, so that should help a bit, but it's by no means like a shotgun either. Okay, maybe we could take it a bit more slowly so I can show you guys what this gun is like here. Uh, it has a custom scope, of course, too. It's, it's super freaking fast and it's pretty f massive, too. It's a 4.5 fast zoom. Uh, so, yeah, that's what that is. I'm going to use it here a little bit, but I would not recommend you use it. Oh, perf. We got a triple, the first triple of the game, maybe? Um, the reason I, of course, I'm, I'm saying you shouldn't use this because, um, you're not gonna, unless you're playing like a classic sniper, which if you are, you should probably be using a bolt action sniper instead of this thing, um, then you normally want to either spam for the body or aim for the head, which are both easier to do with a, uh, a, a scope with lesser magnification. So I'm just going to use it here a bit longer to show you guys what it feels like and what it looks like but then i'm gonna be like trying a bit harder for the headshots and all that stuff so yes you can get an idea of, of what that um maybe what's the best way to play with this gun i'm not sure okay that that was horrible there's quite a few shots there <laughs> uh can we go up there so far this map has not been very promising to say the least Giving a, a ad hoc map review as well here. Oh, what the fuck? How many bullets? How many times do I have to shoot this guy? Oh, let's move over to here. Oh, that's somebody there. It's another headshot. Okay, I think that's the auto sniper. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's switch to this scope here, so you guys can... Actually, no, let's switch to the red dot, because this is probably, like, the best scope to use on this gun. I say that as I get destroyed by that said. Somehow in the lead here, on my team, 
I am a storm master, but still, like, I want to give these people a chance to shine as well, so... I was hoping I could not take first spot so easily. <laughs> I'm gonna be a bit aggressive here, probably to no avail. Never mind. Got him there. Is somebody else gonna push here? I think the set's gonna come again. Nope. Oh, my team's got this covered, dude. I don't even need to debut this, this gun review it to do anything, really. There's no verticala verticality? verticality in this map. <laughs> no boost spots or anything. Oh. I hope, I hope the audio balance is good here because I can't really hear my son. I feel like the, the game audio is like 10 times louder than me. So hopefully that's not the case in the video itself. Can somebody kill that person, please? Oh, we got a kill. Randomly shooting. That always works. As you can see, smoking is very key on Storm. So you should always, always have like 10, 10 or so smokes whenever you... If you can afford it. Oh shit. Yeah, these smokes are pretty strong. Especially with the upgrade they did, the buff they did to smoke grenades. They're even better for, for Storm now. Back when I used- back in my day when I used to play Storm. <laughs> smokes were still ass, but they still like, helped a lot with like, sight capture and all. Oh, that's- that's unfortunate. Actually, you know, this is good. That's all according to my plan, because I wanted to, uh show off and test more of the map here um we're gonna switch to this scope which i like a lot like it's the classic like close range scope that i typically use when i'm uh sniping with uh, on a close or on a more close quarter map even if i'm using a bolt action like it, it looks pretty like the the zoom in animations and all for it are pretty bad but i still like it like it's it's a as a soft spot in my heart, let's say, that this scope. No, oh, no, let's do that. Get some. Uh... Oh no! I was gonna get a triple if there if that rifle didn't hunt me down. It didn't really hunt me down, but still. Oh, oh, no, that's our teammate. Oh, back to s yes, we're back to spraying. Mm. Oh, and these guys are getting good grip here. Smoking their 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 lines of sights, their their pushes and everything. It ain't half bad, mates. Oh, I say that as we start uh, <laughs> dominating them. Okay, let's go back to red dot so I can maybe get a few headshots here in the last minute of the match. Or just die, that works here. <laughs> uh, oh, actually I didn't even think about it, but it's my, my camo here matches the colors of the map here. Another one? Well, that was the first one. Oh, they're actually gonna capture it? Wow. Okay, at least we get to see what this this last spawn point looks like. Okay, it's pretty darn massive here. Oh shit, we got a headshot too. Okay. Yeah, this map doesn't look very good. I'll be honest with you. Like, there's a saying that classics are always the best. And I don't really want to, like, subscribe to that idea. But maybe it's actually true, you know? Maybe it, it'd be true. Oh, one headshot, two headshot. No, I should have gone the hit pressure there. It gave up on my aim. Do that quite a bit sometimes. <laughs> Unnecessarily so. Oh, I was like a little bit off his head there. 
Let's push back in here. Maybe get one last headshot to finish off the game. Oh. Oh, can we? Two seconds. Oh, we do. I almost whiffed there, <laughs> but we're not going to talk about it. <laughs> Anyways, guys, um, that's it for the Cobalt Kinetic 27? Kinetics 27? Um, it's a semi-auto or, or fully auto. I'm pretty sure it's a semi-auto. So right off the bat, I'm not a big fan of those. But um, between semi-autos themselves, I don't think this one is like uh, near the top because of the RPM. Uh, but it does come with a lot of like good um, perks, I guess you could maybe call them. Like the fact that at close quarter, uh, you could sort of almost use it as a shotgun. I don't think other semi or fully auto snipers are that good at close range. Um, and also the fact that as a red dot, that's really um, probably the biggest benefit that it has. The biggest advantage it has over other like semi-autos, which basically makes it into, as I said, a, a better H car. Um, do I even have, I might have the H car on this server, but so if you look at it here, the H car is, is uh, has, Gas 20 bullets in each mag, each clip, and uh, 31 aim, 20 hip accuracy, and all that stuff. 18 range, 250 RPM. And it's sort of like a, I don't know if this is a bad comparison, but I just want to still compare. So, two less bullets on this one, a lot more aim accuracy, a lot more hip accuracy, I believe that is. That was a lot more, wasn't it? Where is the H car? Um, I think I probably, probably passed it. Yeah, I no, oh shit. No, I don't want, <laughs> are we extending this? I don't want to. Okay, boys, sorry for that little ad break, but yeah, as I was saying, like, it has more RPM, more range, more damage, like, I don't see how this is not just much better version of the H car. It's a snipe semi-auto sniper version of the H car, you know, because it has a red dot, a red dot you can put on it. Um, but it's, it's much better than the H car if we compare it like in the sense that like they both have like, they're both like slow, um, in their RPM when you shoot with them and all. Anyways, though, like you guys know how ignorant I am about guns and like how they perform and stuff. So please let me know how wrong I am about this gun. But personally, I, I don't feel like this is a very good or, or powerful gun. And I, I really don't see what situation you would use this in. So, um, at least it's, it's unique looking and everything, but I don't know what it more has to it. The only, only thing about this gun is like it has a red dot. That's all I can see that's good about it. Anyways, that's going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.